Hello everybody, hope you're having a fantastic day today. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Today I got to try my first 4 star legendary weapon basically. And yeah, this is just in the PTS so just throwing that out there. Should be coming to the game soon, but we got to test it here. Let's get into it. Okay, so if you come to this locker, like right outside of Vault 76 um, on the PTS, there is a lot of good stuff in here. Um, I'm, I'm like fairly newer to the PTS. I didn't realize they were going to give us like 300 modules to play around with. Um, we have some new Gatling gun receivers and a bunch of four star legendary mods here. So I was like, okay, let's test some of these out. And one of the better ones I noticed was polished. The greater the equipped item condition, plus 100%, the greater the weapon damage up to 60%. Now what that means is, is the more percentage above 100% your weapon is for the, uh, the um, condition of it, the more damage it'll do. So you have to get it to like 200%. If you have it under a uh, 100% condition or just regular like you know a repair without using an approved repair kit or anything you can see the damage will be the exact same so it's only gets more damage the more you um make that condition bar over a hundred percent if that makes sense so this makes weapon artisan very useful for this so if you use this, you can repair weapons to 200%. So you'll be doing a bit of extra damage, or more than a little bit of extra damage, up until you um, get lower than 100%. And you can see the difference it makes is more than a little bit. Now, of course, this is going to go downhill the more your weapon degrades. Um, I did try it on the Railway Rifle, one of the weapons that breaks a little bit faster with Gunsmith Level 5 on, and it still seems to make more than a little bit of difference which i'm gonna show here um this is right when i first repaired it you can see it's like no problem taking out scorch beast i'm definitely noting or noticing a little bit uh more damage but nothing like game breaking i feel like it's not 60 percent more damage it feels like more like 20 or 30 percent and again i know that condition bar is going down but i do have gunsmith level 5 on and you just wouldn't think it would be going down that fast but yeah it didn't seem like 60 percent but definitely some more damage um just for reference here you can see me taking out a glowing behemoth still like, I can barely notice a difference with that. I was probably still at 180% and more than 150% here taking out the Mire Alert Queen. Um, it did seem a little bit faster still. But this is the PTS as well, so maybe this just isn't, you know, full-on working right now. And like I said, it feels like more like 60% when I first repaired the gun and started to try or started trying to use it. But yeah, definitely a cool little mod. Um, I feel like there's much better weapons that this can be put on, that's for sure. Like the Auto Axe, I know it breaks fast, but this thing already does so much damage. Just imagine applying this mod to it and putting Weapon Artisan on and repairing it. Like, you're gonna destroy a Scorch Beast Queen or Earl super fast. Or even the Gatling Gun. I feel like it'll breathe more life into weapons like this where they don't break very fast. And it's just like a bit of extra damage for a lower powered weapon. I feel like, you know, it would work better on those type of weapons, but I wanted to go ahead and try the railway rifle and see what damage we could get. And so far, I'm not noticing anything game breaking. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments if you've tried any of these mods, if there's any mods you would like me to try. And as always, thank you so much for taking the time to watch the video. Have a great day.